Having too many friends on Facebook clutters newsfeed and make it harder to keep track of your family, friends, and all of the other updates you actually care about. If you have too many friends in the past and now no longer relate to them then by following a few simple steps you can simply unfriend all your Facebook friends easily. Welcome to Newbie Computers Channel. After installation, the extension will appear in the top right corner, you can press the button of the extension to display it. Keep in mind that you may need to reload the Facebook page to make sure the extension is working properly. Go to your account profile page, then select the friends tab menu, you will be taken to the list page of all your friends on Facebook. Then bring up the pop-up dialog of the extension. In the interval in seconds option, you can fill in the value as you like. The default is 5 seconds. If you find it too fast or too slow you can change it here. The next option is ignore list, if you want to exclude some account names from being unfriended, you can add them here. Each account name is separated by a comma, you can add as many as you want. Press the start button to let the script start working. You see the script will work according to the specified options, each action will be delayed for X seconds, and the script will skip the names of the accounts that have been added to the ignore list. The script will also automatically scroll down to show the next item. If it reaches a certain count, the script will attempt to reload the page to update the data. When the script is running, a small box will appear below that informs the number of actions that have been performed and the countdown time delay for each action. The script will continue to work as long as there are items to unfriend or until you stop it by pressing the stop button in the extension dialog box. I didn't speed up this video to show the delay time in real time, so you can understand how this script works and give Facebook a grace period to update their data. The reason I add intervals to each action is so that this action can look as if it was done manually by the user, so your account will be safe from any problems that might occur. I've tried it on my two Facebook accounts and everything is running smoothly without any particular hiccups or issues. This script is really very helpful especially if you have a lot of friends on Facebook, you will be too tired to do it one by one manually. If you pay attention earlier, you can see that this account name is not unfriended because it has been added to the ignore list option as explained earlier. Go to my GitHub page and find the Facebook Unfriend repository, download the zipped code to your PC, extract it and place it where you want it. Go to the extension page in your browser. Ensure that the developer mode checkbox in the top right hand. Click load unpacked extension to pop up a file selection dialog and select your directory. If the extension is valid, it will be loaded up and active right away. Ensure that the enabled box next to your Chrome extension is checked. This 
script works by looking for certain elements to click. The first thing to do is look for the tag name, class, identifier of these elements. I will unfriend manually to see what buttons to click. Right click on the button to be clicked, then select inspect to open the developer console. On the developer console screen, look for the tag name of the button and its attributes. Now that we know that the script must look for a div element with an ARIA label attribute that has the value friends, let's test it by creating a simple script, we will find the element and simulate it with a click event. Copy this script and paste it in developer console, press enter to execute. You will see a drop down menu appear. Next, we will look for elements from the unfriend menu. do the same test as the previous test, but with different tags, namely the span tag, and the dir attribute with the value auto, and contains text with the word unfriend. A confirmation box will appear, for the next we will look for elements for the confirmation button. Once again, we will test in the same way on the confirm button that we have found. You can see, the simulation of unfriend with a simple script has been done successfully. Let's take a look at the contents of the unfollow.js file in the extensions folder related to the tests we just performed. This is so that if one day there is an update in the Facebook layout, and this script doesn't work, then we can modify it to suit the new layout. Mm -hmm. 